my name is Ann Brugos, and I work for the City of Valparaiso in the Public Works Department. And I'm also the coordinator for Shade Brigade. And what we are doing today is planting street trees throughout the Jesse Pfeiffer Ben Franklin Middle School neighborhood. Um, and we've got neighbors who are helping out on the project um, that live in the area that just want to see more trees. For these Shade Brigade planting projects, we really try to pull from the neighborhood where we are planting and get volunteers, um, if not to plant the trees, at least to foster the trees. Um, the city really needs the help of the community to take care of the trees. We have tree stewards here. The tree steward program is a program that's done through the Indiana DNR, through their community and urban forestry office, um, and they train volunteers that want to take a more active role in the trees in their community. So now these tree stewards are passing on that knowledge to the neighbors and that's something that is not only going to help these trees but help any other trees that they might be planting on their private property. My name is Jim Beversdorf. I just learned that I've been chosen as the tree steward of the year for the Indiana Urban Forest Council. quite very honored by that. Uh, it's not of the work of Ann Brogus who submitted what I was doing for the city and I feel honored that they have accepted my work and pleased that they're pleased with it. <laughs> As a Tree City USA, Valparaiso is very interested in keeping that, um, that feel of having these living legends around us. So we are committed um, the trees that for this project have been funded by um, budgeted dollars. The city uh, budgets money every year for tree replacement. These are the only part of our city infrastructure that increases in value as they age. That doesn't happen with roads and sidewalks and water lines. Why I am interested in this, my dad um, lives in Valparaiso. He and some neighbors kind of took it upon themselves to um, start planting sugar maples. He has planted trees all over, and I see some of those. There's an oak tree by Central School that he planted that's like 40 feet tall, and I love that. It is just so cool to be able to leave that legacy for future generations. 